All right, here is a great example of a Gulf sturgeon. These fish occur in seven rivers currently along the Gulf Coast. Four of those rivers are in the state of Florida. They are super cool fish covered in uh, armor-like scales that are actually called scutes. Um, they have sometimes razor on the tips of these scutes, and those are because these fish go into salt water and deal with predators such as sharks and, and other large fish. So they need to be well protected when they go into the marine systems. If we turn this fish over, what's pretty cool is that these fish are always almost feeding on bottom. So they have a subterminal mouth that protrudes out, allows them to suck crabs, shrimp, and other crustaceans off the bottom when they go out into the gulf and the saltwater bays to feed. They have, again, the armor going all the way along the belly and pretty much everywhere around the fish. So there you go, a gulf sturgeon.